So here we are at the checkpoint of Takatna, one of the great experiences for mushers. They say they want adventure. They want to, of course, finish the Iditarod and get all the way from Anchorage to Nome for 1,000 miles. But on the way, you get to meet a lot of interesting characters. Here, Marcel Fresno and who she got to meet overnight. I was between Juan and uh, Nikolai. And there are uh, many bison in this area. But in the middle of the night, there were three, and like in the middle of the trail, so I can't, uh, I have to stop the dogs. It was not easy because they were excited. Then I thought they will go away, seeing a team uh, excited. But no, they, they were too big and one uh, young. The young come near him and uh, I was afraid and the dogs too. He turned back, made a tangle with the other dogs. So I didn't know what to do and uh, I took my axe, I ran near the big one and I said, go away, go away. And he went away <laughs> because I was afraid that they can kick the dogs or you know, we never know how it sticks this kind of animal. Yeah, it could have been bad. It yeah, could have been serious. Yeah, I was really afraid for a time. Yeah. What I think. Have you ever run into a buffalo on the trail before? Uh, yes, in Yukon, but usually they go they go away. And the day after I have a moose in front of the team too. But <laughs> I am more afraid of moose because they, when the snow is deep, they can, uh, they don't want to leave the trail. They stay on the trail, so it could be dangerous. Yeah, you saw moose the the day before that. The day after. The day after, the next day you yes, saw moose. Yes, when I I left Nikolai just after in uh, not far from the village, a, a big moose. <laughs> And I yell, <laughs> and he, he went away because <laughs> he was he also in the middle of the trail. Yeah. So you came after this bison with an axe. Yeah. What were you but gonna not, do? But not. It was just to uh, look more strong, you know, because I know I cannot do anything. The head is so hard; <laughs> it's impossible to to kill with a, an axe and tree. Uh, no, no, but it's just to have something uh, to, to look bigger than, <laughs> than I am. Don't mess with Marcel Fresno. She's still on her way. We expect her to finish. This would be her third Iditarod finish, the Swiss-born musher moving with her dog team. Lots of experience, adventure, and a little bit of excitement as well. You get everything here on the Iditarod Trail for the entire crew from Takatna. I'm Dave Goldman, KTVA 11 Sports.